one about mango tree pest. Before I start, I would like to introduce to you what is a mango tree. The scientific name of mango tree is a Mangifera indica. Mango is the most important fruit of India and is known as a king of fruits. Mango are mainly grown in tropical and subtropical regions. The best temperature for the mango around 27 Celsius. So, let me begin the common pest that attack in a mango tree. Mango fruit pie attacks the female punch the outer wall on the mature fruit, which is pointer over positor and insert it inside the mesocarp of a mature fruit. After hatching, the larvae feed on the pups of the fruit, which appear a normal from outside, but a drop down felling the mature mango fell down into the soil. So the symptom of the mango profile attack is the fruit matured will fell down after the male puncture the outer wall of the matured fruit. So that to control the mango profile is first is culture control. Culture control is proving of the orchard to expose the pupae to sunlight heat which uh, kill them. The secondly is a physical control. Physical control is water hot treatment to fan matured fruit of the 14-8 Celsius for 4 minutes until 5 minutes. The thirdly is a chemical control. Chemical control is take 10 ml of the mixture per trip and keep them at a 25 different phase in 1 hectare between 8 to 6 am. The lastly is the adult can be controlled with a bite spray. that attack the mango crop is a mango skill insect. How a mango skill insect attacks? The yam and adult skill suck the sap of the leaf and other standards fight and reduce the vigors of the plant. So the symptom is the honeydew which help in the development of salty mood on the leaf and other tendon spike of the trees. The control of mango scale insect is pruning of the heavy infection plant parts. They are intermediately destruction followed by two spray of the molots at an interval of 20 days. Shoot borer. How mango shoot borer attacks? Larvae born into the young tendon leaf and hatch the capital bone into the merit. After two days, the borer into tendon shoot near the growing point, turning down and throw their extract, resulting in a dropping of a leaf and wilting of the terminal shoot. The symptom of mango shoot borer is a tip drying. How to control mango shoot borer? Control mango shoot borer is spray is a cabling at a fortnight interval from the commission of a new flush. Here is another three examples of mango pass. The third example of mango pest is mango hopper or known as Amritodes atkinsoni. Mango hopper damage the plant by sucking the sap from inflorescence during flowering season. 
the infested plant shrivel turn brown and finally fall off mango hopper has incomplete life cycle the whole life cycle of mango hopper is completed in 19 to 20 days there are several methods of controlling the mango hopper in the field firstly we can use the cultural control it is considered keep the orchard clean avoiding the overcrowding of trees and avoiding water logging around the mango orchard secondly we can use the chemical method the trees spread with kerosene or crude oil emulsion before the flowering season to prevent pest attack the fifth example of mango pest is mango millibug or known as rosica magnifera the name of both sexes and wingless females suck the plant juice and they will cause tender shoots and flowers to dry out. In survey infestation, literally the millibug covers the whole tree and such tree does not bear any fruit. The sugary secretion from pest body falling on leaves and flowers of the host plant promotes fungal growth. Millibug has incomplete and complete life cycle. Female millibug has incomplete life cycle where the whole life cycle of female millibug is completed within 77 to 135 days. Besides, for male millibug, it has complete life cycle where the whole life cycle of male millibug is completed within 67 to 119 days. The difference between female millibug and male millibug life cycle Female millibug, it does not have a pupa stage in its life cycle, while for the male millibug, it has a pupa stage in its life cycle. Control method for mango millibug considered with cultural method and chemical method. For cultural method, mango millibug nim can be prevented to ascend up on tree branches by bending the tree four feet from the ground level with sticky substance or greasing material or slippery material. Additionally, for chemical method, dusting the soil around the tree bases with malation as an effective preventive measure. The last example of mango pest is mango stone weevil or known as Stenocetus magnifera. The weevil occurs in certain parts of the world like India, Philippines and South Africa. Therefore, it is not a serious pest of mango in every country as it attacks only those varieties which have relatively soft flesh. The mango stone reveal especially infest the sweet varieties of mango like Alfonso, Dusahari and Bangalora. The mango stone weevil attack the mango plant at early stage of fruit development with the freshly hatched crops bore through the pulp feed on seed coat and damage the cotyledon. Mango stone weevil has complete life cycle. The whole life cycle of mango stone weevil is completed within 40 to 50 days. Control method of mango stone weevil including do the management of good orchard sanitation and planting resistant varieties. Also, we can do timely application of insecticides for effective control. As a conclusion, we have identified and studied about the mango pest which have commonly found in our mango crop such as mango fruit fly, mango scale insect, mango shoot borer, mango hopper, mango millibug and mango stone weevil. Early detection and eradication will help to protect our mango crop from infection of pests.